Well, immigration crisis? What immigration crisis? The border is secure. What? Well, Arizona Congressman Ron Barber, a Democrat, says Harry Reid and President Obama have it all wrong. He's going to join us live next. Well, support for President Obama plummeting this morning. The Washington Post reports only 33 percent of Americans support the White House's handling of the illegal immigration crisis along the southern border. Combine that with the president's refusal to tour the Texas border with Governor Rick Perry. It's no wonder more and more Democrats are lashing out. Joining me now, Arizona Congressman Ron Barber, a Democrat who says the administration is making some big mistakes. Congressman, thanks for being with Fox and Friends this morning. Good is morning. this the biggest misstep right now with this administration to not pay more close attention to what's happening at the border? Well, there's plenty of blame to go around. Washington has for too long ignored the problem of illegal immigration, drug trafficking across the border. I'm one of nine Democrats and nine members, I should say, who have a border district. And the people I represent want the border secure. And sure. that's what I'm trying to do. Well, yeah, the burden is falling on, on your lap. Where did the president drop the ball in this specific, we'll, we'll just call it month? Well, there's a number of things that should have been done. First of all, the influx of these children from Central America, I think was predictable as early as January, even maybe back last year. And I think we should have been much better prepared for the influx than we were when they all started showing up in greater numbers. Secondly, there was no notification to local authorities, to my office or to anyone really, before the kids started showing up in, uh, in Southern Arizona. Those are two big mistakes. But now we have to solve the problem. And that's what I've tried to do by signing on to a bill uh, that was uh, introduced by uh, my colleague from Texas, uh, Congressman Cuellar. Right, the Cuellar Corn Bill, uh, which Harry Reid said he's going to take no part in. He doesn't want to participate in because, partly, the border is secure. Do you believe the border is secure? Is Harry Reid delusional? Well, I wouldn't want to characterize the uh, majority leader in any way like that, but I will say this that the people I represent in southern Arizona, and I have 83 miles of the border with Mexico, don't feel secure, don't feel safe in their homes. And until that's done, the border isn't secure from my perspective. So that's what this bill is about in terms of the latest crisis, getting a handle on this situation, solving the problem once and for all that we haven't solved in many, many months and years. We have to get down to solving problems. That's why the people of Southern Arizona sent me to Washington, and that's what I'm trying to do with this legislation. Come November, Charles Krauthammer said that Democrats will be thrashed in these elections. Your opponent has raised a ton of money in just recent month here. Are you concerned about that? Is that why you're taking this harsh position now against the president no. and administration? No, it has nothing to do with that. I've been working on this issue since before I came to Congress. As Congresswoman Giffords District Director, I had the lead for border security matters, and I helped her craft legislation that brought resources to the border. And from the day I stepped into this job as a new member of Congress from the Southern Arizona District, I've been working hard to get, solve, uh, get solutions to the problem. I'm a member of the House Armed Services Committee, ranking member on the Oversight Subcommittee, and I've been pushing hard at every single opportunity to get legislation and to call uh, DHS to be more accountable for getting the border secure. The strategy is wrong, and now we have a new crisis with these kids that are coming sure in, which allowed the cartels, actually, to exploit us in two ways. First of all, they exploit the children by encouraging them to come, taking large amounts of money from them and their yes. families, perilous journey across Mexico, and then They've opened up areas of the border because we pulled Border Patrol agents off the border to care for these kids. That's not their job. Their job is to secure the border. And the cartels are having their way in two different uh, uh, ways of uh, exploiting border absolutely. situations. Absolutely. You know, Congressman, it is absolutely refreshing to hear someone say that on, on the other side of the aisle. We've heard it from Republicans. We thank you for joining Fox and Friends right now with a fresh, clear look here. Very thank good. You. Nice to meet you. Thank you. Same.